Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video at the world of AI. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing a new autonomous AI web front application, and that is called AI Agent. Now, AI Agent application is a web application that provides users with the ability to create an AI agent that can carry out a wide range of tasks autonomously on the web front. Now, this is based off of predefined goals that you give it. And this application allows you as a user to name your own AI agent according to a specific task that they will perform, such as conducting a product research, managing social media accounts, creating personalized workout plans, assisting with job search, and much more. And in today's video, we're going to dive a little bit deeper as to what you can actually do with this application, as well as taking a look at the demo that we will be taking a look at, showcasing you all the features, the goals of this web application, as well as some of the key advantages advantages of using AI agent. So with that thought, before we actually get into the gist of the video, it'd mean the whole world to me if you guys can go give this video a like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys haven't followed the Twitter page already, make sure you do so. I'm going to be posting the latest AI news over here so you can get the latest content as well as the latest AI news over here. Make sure you guys subscribe, turn on the notification bell, and if you guys haven't seen it in my previous videos, I highly recommend that you do so, as there's a lot of content and a lot of value that will, you will definitely benefit from. So with that thought, let's get right into the video. So to achieve a given goal with AI Agent, you're able to break it down into smaller tasks that the AI Agent can complete step by step. Now this is very similar to many of the autonomous AI Agents that are out there already, such as Agent GPT, Baby AGI, as well as Auto GPT. Now, the AI agent application is able to execute these top tasks by generating additional tasks necessary to accomplish the overall goal, which we can see in this demo right over here. You're able to prioritize the task and it iterates it through a process that is able to basically define the goal until it's successfully achieved. Now, one of the key advantages of using AI agent is its capability to run multiple AI agents autonomously and simultaneously. And this is a feature that can significantly enhance the business process and optimize the workflow by following and allowing users to delegate different types of tasks and separate AI agents effectively by multiplying their productivity over the actual application's use case. One of the main benefits of AI Agent is that you're able to access GPT-4 and this is something that does not require an API key. So this is a way you can access GPT-4 for free and run autonomous AI agents with this application that utilizes GPT-4. You have a clean and simple UI, which I'll showcase later on in the video in which we'll go through a demo as well as running our own autonomous AI agent to do something that is quite remarkable. You're able to have a full control of the tasks where in which you can actually add different types of tasks that accomplishes the goal that you gave it initially. You can edit a certain type of prompt or a certain type of task as well as helping the AI generate certain types of content that is best fit to achieve the overall goal that is given. So guys, one thing I wanted to note, this is not a pre promo or anything as they actually have their own pricing. But one of the things I wanted to emphasize is that it's they have their own free feature, which is something that I'm going to utilize. And this is something I recommend that you utilize. Don't pay for this stuff because I highly recommend you don't as you're not going to be doing certain things where you're going to require 30 task agents a month. You're not going to be doing these types of things unless if you're going to be running a business off of this application. Uh, in my case, I recommend this free version, which gets you access to a lot of amazing features and helps you do the basic minimum of using an autonomous AI agent for your own tasks. So keep that in mind before you actually use it. One thing that I want to note is that you can only use GPT 3.5. I want to correct myself because for the GPT 4 access, you're going to have to have the starter pack, but 3.5 is worthy enough to actually run your own autonomous AI agent. So I highly recommend you stick with the free version. And with that thought, let's get into the next part where we actually showcase what you can actually do with this application. Overall, by using these templates, users can actually save time and effort in the initial step of setting up your own AI agent. Now, instead of 
actually starting from scratch, you can actually select your own template that closely matches your desired functionality. And this way you can customize it according to your specific needs. Now with these templates, you're able to provide a structured framework that includes predefined tasks, workflows, and configurations, which allows you as a user to quickly get started with your own AI agent. Now, this template is offered by AI agent which are designed to incorporate the best practices and the industry standard, which are created based on extensive research and expertise. And this is something that you can actually check out on their blog posts as to what they've been actually able to do in terms of creating this amazing application. So if you are interested as well as getting some updates as to what they're doing on the back end, I highly recommend that you check out this blog so that you can get a better idea as to what they're actually trying to do. There's also a feedback tab in which you can incorporate your own feedback as to how you can improve this application there's chain logs which will give you updates as to the latest roadmaps as well as what they have been incorporating into their application for example recently on june 14th which was yesterday they have been able to increase their token limit by 300 percent which is quite remarkable you're going to be able to get lar larger contextual responses with this new update now let's actually get into the next focus where we start working on creating our own AI agent. So with that thought, let's get into the next step where we create our own AI agent. Now, before we actually get into the demo, I want to talk a little bit more about the differences between other autonomous AI agents, such as auto GPT, baby AGI, as well as other web applications that provide an autonomous AI agent application. Now, as we know, AI agent is a web application that enables you as a user to create your own AI agent on the web front. You're able to utilize GPT-4 technology, as well as emphasize on task management, workflow optimization, and seamless integration with third party platforms. With auto GPT, on the other hand, it refers to more of an automated process of training and fine tuning the GPT language model architecture. It involves using large language models to perform across various tasks and domains. With Baby AGI, you're able to work towards achieving artificial general intelligence with a hypothetical AI system that possesses general intelligence similar to humans. It refers to AI models or architectures that aims to go beyond narrow AI tasks and exhibits broader understanding and reasoning abilities. So all three autonomous AI agents have their own specific needs as well as the use cases as to how it performs as an autonomous AI agent. Now, one thing I want to showcase before we actually go in, uh, there's a lot of testimonials that you can check out. I don't really care about checking that. There's chain logs that you can check out. The blog post that is over here, there's different features that are going to be coming out. You have an algorithm. Uh, all stars which is able to tag into a colorful array of AI personalities you have a crystal clear code feature which is featuring inline code blocks with syntax highlighting that evaluates your coding experience you have different things where keys are included as in terms of the different domains that are integrated within the application you have a UI that is very, very beautiful you're able to utilize GPT-4 with the paid plan but with that thought, let's get into the next focus where I showcase a little bit more about the demo. But first things first, you're going to have to create your own actual account. You can sign in with Google. It's completely free. So once I have done that, I'll be right back. So in terms of the different LMs that you can utilize, you can actually play around with it. You can utilize Hugging Face. Anthropic is another one. But I believe you cannot access these at the current moment with the free plan. Maybe eventually they might incorporate it within the free plan, but you can utilize these different types of LLMs. Now, another thing that you can do is set the type of model, uh, model, sorry. Uh, I'm going to be utilizing the GPT 3.5 Turbo. Uh, with In terms of the actual agent, you can have an architecture which is focused on baby AGI or auto GPT. In this case, I'm going to use auto GPT. Uh, you can have different tool sets an output of an ui have a prompt that you can give it as an seo writer this is something that is over here that is inputted into this prompt feature over here the memory is custom you can set different presets as to where the memory is saved i believe they have their own hosting of where their memory is saved uh, you can utilize different tools such as search cal calculator api connector read and write files and much more as you upgrade with the future plan which i don't highly recommend 
but in terms of doing menial tasks, this is highly recommended. You can do some of the templates that are provided over here and see more by going over to the template. Now I'm going to formulate a certain type of prompt and give it to the actual agent. And then once it is, has been created, I'll be right back to you guys. So guys, I decided to actually just use one of the templates, which is a cold email generator. And I gave the agent this name. I chose the 3.5 free model. I'm going to be giving it a skull where it generates a personalized and effective cold email template to connect with potential clients or customers for a design studio. Now, once you are done with the actual prompt that you give it, you can start this agent and it will start working towards creating your actual goal as well as the tasks that are needed to complete this overall goal now what you can see over here there's active tasks on the left side as well as archived and which you can access later on now which we can see over here right now you have given tasks there's 10 different tasks that are given and which you can actually add on towards later on you can generate with ai and you can also have a continuous mode which is currently off but you can basically click next once you have checked it out. So we can see right here, it has created tasks. Firstly, it has research potential clients in the design industry, analyze successful cold email templates used by design studios. And these are some of the tasks that are actually added on with the overall objective. And once you have basically looked it over, you can click continue and it will start thinking towards completing these tasks. Now this might take a couple of seconds, but once this is done, I'll be right back. So as after a given task is put into the task list, once it has been finished, it will then give you a prompt in which you can continue on towards the next task. But if you want to edit something, you can do so by going towards adding a task and working towards completing or editing it. Now, in this case, it actually gives you the actual references to where it found the information, which is quite beneficial. And this way you have a way to go back and look towards the sources as to where your information has been provided. So once that is done, you can click continue and work towards the next task. So for this video's sake, I'm going to actually take out some of these task lists because they're kind of irrelevant and I kind of don't want them. So I'm just going to take it out and get to the final step, which I'll showcase to you how it actually finishes the overall objective that we gave it at the start. All right, guys. So I finally got this proposed cold email template at the end. I took off some tasks that were irrelevant and i actually added this one schedule and send a cold email to potential clients now in terms of actually accessing this you're gonna have to connect a gmail api connector onto this application so i believe that is something that you can do with the priced plan so this is not actually incorporated with the free plan but if you're going to get to this stage where you can develop a free draft, you can copy this, take it onto your Gmail and send it out to different types of actual leads that you have. Now, in summary, this was something that you can do with the cold email template. Now, there's also different things that I highly recommend that you check out with the different types of templates, which we talked about before. Something else that is really, really helpful is this SEO writer. This is something that is very beneficial for people who are writing blogs for different types of businesses, as well as people who own your own SMAA business, which is a social media marketing agency. So I highly recommend that you check this out, guys. And in summary, this is an amazing application that offers a selection of templates that cover various different types of autonomous AI applications. I hope you got some sort of value out of today's video, guys. If you want to check out something else, please comment down in the, in the description below. If you guys haven't already, make sure you give this Twitter account a follow. Subscribe, turn on notification bell, like this video. And if you guys haven't seen any of my previous videos, definitely do so as there's a lot of content, a lot of value that you'll definitely benefit from. So with that thought, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.